So it reminded the laugh, laugh, laugh. It's funny because it's true. This set of jokes, bad neighbors. Now let me start off by saying, y'all, that all of this really happened. I'm not changing the names to protect the guilty. I'm just leaving them out. Here we go. Y'all, I had a neighbor who may have been a very nice man, but he had a proclivity that I just, as all the notes would say, I just can't go for that. He liked to feed the ducks. Now you say, Shell, well, what's the big deal? Ducks got to eat too. Yeah, but what do you do after you through eating? Do you want them ducks doing that by your house? Next to your yard? I don't think so. It was his yard. It was the laundry room. And it's my yard. He feeding the ducks like they're children, like they're human. Three times a day. Minimum. Because you know they get a snack too. So he would get reported and he would keep doing it. He would get reported and he would keep doing it. It was a vicious cycle. Okay. And they would desiccate in the summer, in the hot, in Indianapolis, next to my yard. But you fix my ability to sit outside because the aroma is not pink sugar. He don't live here no more. So I hope him and the ducks, wherever they are, are very happy. Now I have a wonderful neighbor. He's a very nice man. Very nice. Keeps his yard up and everything. Beautiful mulch, I'm just saying. <sighs> then the neighbor, I had a grown man who lived across the street from me who asked me, can I borrow a dollar and pay you tomorrow? My response was, wait till tomorrow and buy what you want. That happened. Okay. Because if you can ask me, I can say no. Now, y'all, I love black and white movies. In the movie, His Girl Friday with Rosalind Russell and Kerry Grant, she told him, I'm not good enough to make this up. This happened to me. I'm not changing the names of the guilty. I'm just leaving them out. I had a neighbor who was a unique individual. She was she was hardworking. She was she was hardworking, and she was polite. She had two dogs, a big dog, bark bark, and a little dog, bark bark. The little dog bark bark all the time time. My daddy said. I need to stop being so friendly and talking so much. This was the one day he was right. We were having a wonderful conversation. She was in her yard. I was in my yard. And she was talking about how she bathes her dog. Z plural. Two. Bah. Let me tell you what she told me. Let me tell you what she told me. You ain't ready because I wasn't ready. And I'm grown, grown. Y'all, she said, when I bathed the dogs, I, I would get so wet. Okay, where are you going with this story? So now I just put them in the tub and I get in the tub with them, with your clothes on, right? First of all, we ain't gonna, okay. The way my mind works, I'm bathing you in my house and you're not a human. You know, my mom or my dad are unable to be, be able to take care of yourself. But no. Now, no judgment, but my clean on meter is like, woo -hoo. So, she said, no, I, I get in there and I bathe them and then I bathe me in the same water. You're not bathing, you exchanging dirt, chemicals, and probably fleas and ticks and stuff. Now, no matter what my mouth may say, my face is telling you the truth. 
I don't have a good poker face. So I don't know what my mouth said, if anything. But my face was probably like this. Like, you got to be me. And then, not only did you do it, you're, you, you're telling me you're doing it. Which means it's okay for me to tell you she did it. If she wasn't such a nice person, I would probably move down. <laughs> and then, then she offered me something to eat. I told her, I said, girl, I'm fasting. Do I look like I fast? <clears throat> Did you hear what I said? Rewind it if you missed it. Because I just told you, this woman told me she bathes naked in her tub with her dogs. Big dog, bark, bark, little dog, bark, bark. Are you serious with me right now? <sighs> yeah. I want to thank y'all for watching this week. Laugh, laugh, laugh. It's funny because it's true. People do this. They need to be stopped, corrected or something. Not, not conviction. No, not condemnation, but some conviction. You in the bath water. What animal? I don't give a darn if it's Moses' animal. It's still an animal. I love, <laughs> I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. Love and blessings always. I will see you back here next week. Remember, S L S. Subscribe once, like and share every time. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>